Chosen ones, where you are. Chosen ones, they are going to ask you, who are you? If anybody asks you, who are you? Tell them, you are the chosen one. And if they ask you, why are you the chosen one? Let them know that you don't fit in. You are not like anybody. You are not just like anybody. You don't belong in the group. All right. And that is why you are chosen. You are being ye separate. You are being ye positioned. You are unique and special. You are one of a kind. You are one in a million. All right. You don't fit in at all. That is why you love your own solitude. That is why you are a loner. That is why you are single. And sometimes this journey of being uh, single, being lonely, being um, you know in your solitude, it could be depressive. It could be filled with anxiety and fear. It could be filled with a lot of you know negative stuff. You know, poking you, but you still um, can't just fit in. And that is the time God used to visit you. That is the time God visits you. That is the time God works on you. That is the time God touch you. Okay. When you are being ye separate, you are being ye positioned. You are being, you know, given a special seat where you don't fit in. You don't belong in there. All right. And that is what makes you a chosen one. Sometimes this thing is happening to you, but you don't know why this is happening to you. It is because you are the chosen one. If people ask you, why are you the chosen one? You are the chosen one because you are the truth seeker. You seek for the truth, no matter what. All right? Because you know. That is only the truth that will set one free. It is only the truth that will set you free. And for the truth to set one free, the one must know which lies are keeping him or her in bondage, in hostage, in captivity. All right. And you being the chosen one, you know that it is only the truth that is going to stand the test of time. It is only the truth that is going to last forever. It is only the truth that will stand. And no matter how long a lie is being sustained, the truth will one day suffice because the truth gets the beginning and the end. It will endure everything. It cannot be suppressed forever. The truth will one day prevail. So you, as a chosen one, you are a seeker of the truth. If you find yourself being the seeker of the truth, then you are a chosen one. When people ask you, who are you? Tell them, you are the chosen one. Why? Because you are born highly intuitive, right? You follow your intuition. Your intuition always directs your ways. Your intuition knows the way. Your intuition keep ordering your step. And you obeying your intuition makes you feel good, make you feel okay about yourself. Hence, you are a chosen one. Yeah, you are a chosen one because you question everything. Things don't just make sense to you. And you question everything around you. You question all the people around you, you see everything, you see injustice everywhere, you see corruption everywhere, you see things going on in this world and you don't just like it. All right. And you question everything. All right. And that is what makes you a chosen one because only few people question everything. People only accept, 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 accept. But if you are a chosen one, you don't just sit without question things. You question everything. And when you question everything, you get answer because you are the truth seeker. So when you question everything, you begin to receive confirmations such as synchronicities, repeated numbers, such as you watching this video right now. Maybe you asking yourself, 
who are you you don't understand yourself boom you come across this video this video pop up on your youtube you know platform and you start to watch that is synchronicity for you or you question everything you open your bible boom then god starts to speak to you what you're thinking of you start finding an answer to what you're thinking of you are the chosen one right you don't understand yourself you you don't fear anything you know things begins to happen for you all right and um it's like there is somebody following you that is there is an unseen hand directing your ways all right it's like things you think you cannot endure you cannot survive it you just overcome you know that the, 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 the way has been created all right you face the red sea and you feel like you are an, at the end of yourself but before you know boom something happens then there is a way a way is being created for you all right just like that you feel like you know there is god there is something, there is something around, there is something that keeps directing you. Anytime you are in a difficult situation, you are at the end of yourself, maybe you're crying, maybe you're praying, maybe you, you are rejected, disappointed, betrayed, and you think that is the end of you. All right? And you're worried about what is happening. But before you know, boom, then a way is being created and you are out of that challenge or problem. You are the chosen one right if you feel inwardly that you are a chosen one yes you are a chosen one nothing can stop that if you think about yourself and feel about yourself and believe about yourself all right and see that you are a chosen one you are indeed a chosen one don't let anybody lie to you that you are not a chosen one you are the chosen one you are chosen by the most high god sometimes you might not even know but watching this video will help you know that you are chosen you are chosen because life is so difficult for you it's so tough for you you go into a life situation and it's like everybody is getting the break. Everybody with little effort, they are getting the break. They are getting the breakthrough. They're passing through. They're sailing through. But you, as a chosen child of God, it is hard. It is so difficult for you to break through. Right? You have to struggle. You have to toil. You have to sweat. You have to put in so much effort before you get what you want. Things doesn't just happen easily for you. All right? Gambling is not your thing. Sticking lotto is not your thing. This overnight success is not your thing. Quick successes are not your thing. You have to put in efforts before things work out for you. Ha! I'm telling you, you are the chosen one. Right? You are surprised by my voice, by what I'm saying in this video. Yes, it is because you are the chosen one. And I am here to tell you that you are the chosen one. Don't ever give up don't fit in that is the number one point that i raise that if you don't fit in it means you are the chosen one never ever fit in don't conform to the things of this world i said don't conform to the things of this world you are ye separate right you are special you are not just like everybody. You are unique. You are fearful and wonderfully made. In fact, you are a chosen one. I believe this video has gone a long way to help you understand who you are. And now you know that what you're going through is not just for nothing sake, but it is because you are the chosen one. Yes you are the chosen one all right you are the chosen one if you feel deep within you that you have something to share with this universe all right you you, you feel you are pregnant of something you are pregnant of an information and you are willing okay to give it out selflessly to the world to everybody around you to anybody who wants to listen that 
is another sign that you are a chosen one. You are a chosen one. You are a chosen one. I said you, you watching this video, you are a chosen one. If you click on this video, you are a chosen one. In fact, we are all chosen ones, chosen by God. We are all descendants of Abraham by faith. All right. We are all what descendants of Abraham by faith. All right. So we are all chosen ones. You are chosen and not forsaken. You are the chosen one. You are the chosen one. You are the chosen one. I'm out.